In the previous video, we used AC Safe to clean our residential um, air conditioning um, condenser at the house. Well, today we're out here at our family gym, and um, to clean this one, it would require potentially 10 or so more cans of these, and I have two units. So, you know, you're looking at 160 bucks minimum to, to really foam these out. And so that got me thinking. My units say clean coils using water only. This is an inert cleaner. The commercial grade cleaners are super acidic or super basic. And so that's, that's where you wanna stay away from that. But something like this should be safe. But I don't wanna spend 160 bucks. And this really didn't foam up as well as we wanted in our last video. So we're doing away with that. I decided to bring my foam cannon. And I'm gonna be using Adam's Car Shampoo. I like this one, this is one I keep at the house. And what's nice about this is it safely removes dirt, pollen, which is what these things are full of, soot and other contaminants, doesn't remove wax or sealants or dry out plastic or rubber. And it can be, or the formula prevents spotting even when washing in direct sunlight, which today we're in direct sunlight. So we don't want a soap that is gonna leave any type of film, wax or coating on these coils. So that's where I'm gonna try this, uh, or I've been trying this Adam's Car Shampoo. So I'm gonna show you what I do and it comes out perfectly and it only costs about four and a half ounces of Adam's Car Shampoo. First step, wash out the big chunks with your pressure washer. Make sure that your unit is de-energized and your, your breaker is flipped or um, like on the previous video, video, if you're doing it on your residential ones, pull that um, disconnect out and close it up. And we're keeping a decent distance because remember we want to protect those fins. All right, now for the fun part. If you remember, or well, if you watched the other video, this was less than stellar as far as being a foaming cleaner. You know, the only nice thing about it was you get this cool cap that you can use to straighten up your bent pins. But as far as foaming, it didn't do a very good job. I've been using, this is like a $16 foam can, and I have had this, uh, I don't know, go back through my videos, there's a car wash video, that was at least, but six years four years ago? We've so, had it for like six. Okay, so this $16 foam cannon is still going strong. And what I like about it is we've got our atoms, we've got like three ounces of atoms, and then I um, fill your bottle up and... That is a much better foam. And uh, it's pushing it all the way through to the other side. There's a million little scrubbing bubbles are helping to dislodge that pollen and it doesn't cost pennies. Now that we've got it good and coated, we're gonna let that set. And what that's doing is, is the foam is slowly rolling out, pulling pollen and, and all that gunk that's been getting trapped in there um, both on the inside and on the outside and so we're going to let that let that linger here for a couple minutes and then we're going to wash it with our straight nozzle again and take a look if it's clean great we're going to move on to the next one if it's still dirty throw another round of suds at it wash it back out and just rinse and repeat and uh so that's your quick tip for the day. This worked perfect on my other unit over there. So uh, we're gonna get this unit cleaned out and you guys have a wonderful day.